Now, if you don't have 20 golden feathers, because I don't, <laughs> uh, you can get it from... You can go back to the Forbidden Woods if you want. It's not too far away. Um, but if you don't want to, you can also get it uh, from those big-ass birds, the Kagaroks. So you guys might be wondering, what the heck am I doing in here? Why am I in Dragon Roost Cavern? Well, I thought about it, and I'm like, hey, I could farm Joy Pendants and the Golden Feathers in this. Because all I have to do here is do this. Do this. Right? Leave the room. How many do I got now? I have six, so I need one more. And then I have them all. And I come back in, and it resets. So you've been through this cave before. As long as you, you know, blew those barrels up, you could do that. Uh, warp. Because now I want to warp. Warp. Uh, because now I have 40, so I'm just going to bring the seven to Mrs. Whatever her face is in Winfall Island uh, later. Okay, guys. You see this pot here? I figured it out. So we're going to come through here. The door of the, the pot room. What? <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, so we did go the right way. I, I kind of had a feeling it was through one of these rooms. We just come through here, and Bamo, he's here. Do the grappling hook, uh, cancel it, and then run back inside, come back out, and you can get another golden feather. So you can just kind of spam this golden feather. Of course, if you're going to sell stuff, just go with the joy pendants, because they cost as much. But the difference is, um, you know, these are... Um, we're, we're just getting these for now. Like, you know, there's one bird there, right? So there's two of the moblins there. So we would get more joy pendants if you're going to sell them. But uh, of course, we had to farm for both. And now I have the seven joy pendants I was missing that I will take to that teacher, which I said I would do later on, but I guess it's only like an episode or two later. Um, and we're going to do the feather thing now that we have to do with 20 feathers. And Link's pretty relieved about that. He's like, I'm tired of this shit. Now that we got all the uh, collecting done. Ooh, mailman. Mail time. We're going to go to this, uh, this guard. And we're going to offer him 20 feathers that he wants. And he'll be like, hey, that's what my girlfriend wants. A golden feather. So how many of those do you have? So are you really going to let me have 20 of those? Sure. Really? Are you sure? Yes. I'm gonna stick these little beauties in a letter and send them off right away. I'm gonna tell her all about you too. I'm so happy. Seriously. It's not too much. Please accept this. What we got? What? That's supposed to be a piece of heart. Excuse me? That's supposed to be a piece of heart. Okay, we're back out here. And so, I wasn't wrong. Uh, what happens is, he'll give you the rupee. And then later his girlfriend's gonna send you a letter. But a piece of heart. So basically, I just skipped a day. I used the song of passing twice. I skipped a whole day, and I got the piece of heart. So you could just do that. Um, just so you know, you don't wait for it. You just kind of get it. This song of passing is an O P O P. Uh, just like the sun song. It's O P O P. So, yeah. All right. So now we're gonna head one square region east uh, to do a little game thing, and. Uh, get a piece of heart from it as well. So, lots and lots and lots and lots of pieces of heart. Alright, here we are. This area. This spot. Uh, place. Uh, we gotta come over here to get up. It looks like... If the boat wants to... Boat! Come on! Go! Move it! Move your arse. Yeah. Dead arse. Dead body arse. Yeah, I told you to move your arse. Also, logic? Anywho, we come up here. This place is pretty cool, honestly. This place is really, really cool. This place is awesome. I've actually never seen this place before. Ugh! Greetings, old person who has surely come to take the challenge of the big sky. This is where you can register for the official Rito Tribe Birdman Contest. <gasps> Beak looks really weird. <laughs> and now listen, you are free to use any means, methods, or tools you have at your disposal to help you soar through the sky. Just to see how far you can go before you crash into the rolling seas like so much dead weight dripping. The banner stands show at the site where the great and talented champion who has flown the farthest to date crashed. Frothy waves and a massive, 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 
Can't speak. Massive splashes of glory. And then if you're able to pass that flag, you will be the champion. So, uh, basically, I think you want to just become the champion, and then you're going to be so hard. It's not that hard. Not that hard. Not that hard. It's not that hard. Also, I just realized we're already at 11 hearts, I think. See the banner far off this that might strike distance is set by our champion. So, we want to go farther than that, basically. Uh, so first off, of course, yes, saw that's coming. What we want to do is change the wind. That's pretty easy, right? Um, now, we want to wait for those. This first one's really close, so there's no worry. Well, we kind of want to pause for a second. And wait for those. Um, and, th and then we can go. And we're going to use our deck lead, of course. Um, so I can't remember which one we want to wait for. I think it's the second one. We want to wait for it to do what it just did. Uh, and, and go! Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. No. No! 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 Come on! Come on! Come on! No! No, you gotta be kidding me! No! Fudge. I did it wrong. It's okay. I'll get it right eventually. Sploosh! Sploosh! <laughs> Sploosh! Damn it. Also, what's awesome just to say is, uh, you don't have to worry about your, um, uh, magic meter, because it, res they restore it, so, yeah. Uh, and I think this time I got it! Yes! Come on! We can do it! We can do it! We see Mo! Yeah! Yeah! We did it! Dora! The- No! Fuck! Okay, I'm o I'm okay. I just gotta make sure I hit this one. That? Wait, I don't need to worry about that? <gasps> no way, I'm gonna hit the water! Just keep going. Just keep going. I'm almost there. No! What? Did I win? Does that count as a win? Cool. Congratulations. That did count as it. Even though my feet touched the water, I didn't sploosh yet. All breathtaking, you've shown me an incredible feat of aerial navigation. My eyes, they are unworthy. Does that mean I I think I did do it? Amazing, you blew my brother's best record in impressive fashion. You make a fine and distinguished member of the Rio tribe. I guarantee it. The former champion upstairs says so too. You're both great and talented. So new champion Burman contest, please accept it. Yes, that did work. Accurate. So you only need the second one. You don't even need any of the others. You just need the second one and you can win just by, you know, mashing the... The, the deck relief um, button to make it go float, float, float. So that's that's pretty awesome. And I'm sure I'm sure I'm positive I can beat that score. Oh god, this guy's here. <laughs> I'm sure I can beat that score, but that was uh, pretty awesome. And I'm gonna get a bit. No. Fuck you two game. Um, I'm sure you could actually get your magic meter back by paying 10 rupees, jumping off, and just falling into the ocean. Um, because you'll get your magic meter back. But, you know, I'm not gonna do it. I'm not gonna be that guy, so. Let's go, Bodhi. How did that miss? Don't look at me like that. I don't know why I missed. Alright, guys. We're gonna go down one. You know, the south. The southeast portion. Uh, uh, the southeast to Dragon Race, which is south. So, yeah, we're gonna do that. I bet we got something to grab. Wait, did I do the submarine? We'll find out. I'm gonna find out right now. It's right here. It's right here. So I'm gonna find out. If I didn't, I'm just gonna cut it right now. And we'll go back to sailing. Here we are. I don't know if I have to kill these cannons, though. But here we are. Anyways. So, whatever. Um, also, the submarine, I don't think we went to it. I don't recognize it, but it was creepy and scary, and I decided not to. And it was a good decision, too, because, uh, yeah. Fuck that. So 
Fuck that. <laughs> so I'll find out in a second about that. No, well, I already got the joy penis I needed, so. You know, get rid of it. That's what I say now. When I find out I need more and I have to select the creditors. Take the enemies and open the treasure chest. And I should get treasure chart number. 44. Yes? Yes? Yes, treasure chart. Oh, look at this guy dead beside it. Oh, he actually is dead. Huh. All of them. So, our next stop, we're gonna head two squares west. But, there is a big octo you can fight if you go one square west from here first. Um, so passing through. And, the big octo, um, it's an eight-eyed octo. And it will drop a 200 rupee that you can pick up once you uh, beat him. So do that if you would like. I totally forgot to turn that on. <laughs> but I'm going to skip past that because, yeah, just, just look for the seagulls. It's in the, it's in the south area uh, of the region. So, uh, yeah, but I'm heading two squares north. Uh, not north, west. You just want to come one square west which is actually this area so we'll see you guys in the next square all right guys we're here we are here we are here there's actually something you can grab there too if you want uh, it, you can see the little light I avoid grabbing rupees because I don't know I have a lot and um, <clears throat> I mean you ne you'll need them you'll need a bit for tingle but uh, I don't know I I seem to get a lot in oh not what I wanted I didn't do that no one saw that I had to do that uh, <laughs> interesting oh the, the little coral coal guys you know those guys yeah that that thing those guys oh there we go <laughs> it took me so long to drop down anywho we're gonna actually talk to this great fairy and we're not just gonna get you know any normal upgrade okay no it is a normal upgrade we get a bomb upgrade from her so that's pretty nice we just used a bomb to get her to get to her so you know if you were out of bombs the bomb upgrade would have helped for that, but <laughs> I feel that's a little weird. It's uh, a little, a little strange there, but uh, <laughs> yeah, <clears throat> cause uh, it maxes it out. See, I have 60 already. Um, in my uh, items, it already says 60. Here, I'll show you actually. And I caught the poor little fairy this time. No mercy. See, 60. Look, 60. So, <laughs> the thing is, with that, uh, 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 but, uh, you make me get a bomb if I had no bombs. If you're somebody with no bombs, you're kind of like fudge, because you have to go get bombs, and then, then you can do that. Uh, then you can get this, but then it maxes the bombs to 60, so, that's a little bit of a annoying thing, if you have no bombs, that is. Alright, so now we're gonna head... One square east, and two squares down to the south. Um, uh, it's three squares below Dragon Roost Island. Now, if you're collecting rupees, there's some uh, treasure charts that you can get that have rupees around Dragon Roost Island. So before you do that, um, you know, you can go ahead and get that done. Uh, the four areas are Eastern Fairy Island, which is southwest of Dragon Roost Island, Tower of the Gods, which is south of Eastern Fairy Island, Star Belt Ar Archipelago, Archipelago, I think I said that right, I'm not sure, uh, south east of Dragon Roost Island, and Eastern Triangle Island, which is to south of Dragon Roost Island. But we're just gonna get to the third area, which we're basically almost at, so we're not really skipping it, because I had to say all those things. 
but that's okay. Uh, we're heading to Balm Island. Um, so if you want to skip it, go ahead. You don't want to grab the rupees. That's that's totally fine. Uh, I'm not gonna grab the rupees, but I believe they're all 200 rupees. One of them might be 100, but it looks like they're all 200. Um, I can't see one of them, which is why they're either <laughs> one of them's either just uh, 100, and the other three are 200, or it's just uh, they're all 200. So yeah, you can go ahead and grab those. A lot, a lot of rupees. Um, I might actually come back to collect. The rupees that I didn't collect. Ooh, wait, is that? I thought there would be people there. M more like buckleblins, joy pendants. But I mean, I don't really need those. I I got I got the joy pendants I needed for Mrs. Whatever her face is. Um, <laughs> did I even give her that yet? No, I did not. I did not get that treasure chart yet. Um, yeah, like, we're gonna drop down here. But um, yeah, I I will. I might end up collecting all those rupees at one time and not do it during this. Just because I think I will probably end up doing that if... If, um... What am I trying to say? Grr, I, I can't speak today. I, I do apologize. Um, <laughs> I'm a little tired. But I gotta record and I, I gotta do this for you guys, right? So... Alright guys, sorry about that uh, sudden cut. I kind of screwed up, <laughs> so I had to try again. You know, Marley things. Um, and fudge! So <laughs> you're supposed to slowly get through there, hit the switch, um, and then you can walk along that platform. But what I was uh, trying to say before, when I screwed up, uh, was I will probably get the rupees that the treasure charts have um, that I can collect when I'm doing the tingle stuff I'll probably grab them then and I'll show it off because I'm still showing it off um, I'm mentioning them you know through these last few episodes but I will probably do something like that so I can still show it off while I need the rupees too so I'm probably gonna do that anywho uh, okay now that we're done that part uh, what we want to do is there are some of those bugs. Oh, they're up here. Okay. So, as you can see, there's fire in these three spots. And, uh, we kind of want to throw these guys in there. So, it's going to be interesting. Uh, oh, didn't want to do that. I want to throw them. Eh? Eh? Oh, I missed go ah did I get it I think I got it in guys yep all right so all you have to do is just kind of get it in they don't have to stay there like I got that one in a couple minutes ago and then I just got this one in so I thought you had to get them both in um, and have them both there at the same time but apparently you don't so I, I overthunk it I overthought it because <laughs> thunk is not a word, so... We got piece of heart! Piece of heart! Piece of heart. Piece of heart. Yeah. Sexy piece of heart. Oh, shit. Ah!